yourself. This one is louder than the last. Milady, please tell us. Why were you in this physical form? Why fight us? I do not know. The soul of a Valkyrie cannot remain pure in a physical body. We belong in the spirit world, which is where I now go. Goodbye! I... I wouldn't want to speculate. You know something. I'm Nimia, the smartest man alive. I know many things. Ted? Uh... Sigrun, the Queen of the Valkyries. She would have that power. The last time I saw her, she was corporeal herself. She came to visit me long after I'd been imprisoned by Odin. Why? Well, we had... History, I guess you could say. Like... Romantic history? Ah, oh, lad. You're making me blush. I think. Can I still blush? First we hunt these creatures, and now we chase your former lover. We do not need this distraction. It's more than a distraction. Father, these are Valkyries. They're the ones who keep the dead from overrunning Midgard. Then they are terrible at their job. It's not their fault, brother. Someone changed them. Kept them from their duty. The Queen? I can't say for sure, lad. We should ask more of them. If, of course, you don't mind that distraction. Atreus, to me!
are done here. Freed me. Who did this to you? I remember only pain and my queen. She 
She locked me down here? But why? Ah, oh, Sigrun. Well, I must leave you now. I must find her. I must remember. Sounds like your queen is responsible, Head. Aye. When I saw her last, she was different. Changed. And not just that she was in physical form. She was more volatile. She... I tried to talk to her about it, but... She had just come to say goodbye. I didn't think. I'm sorry, Mimir. We'll find her. Not sure she wants to be found. I just don't understand why she would do this. It doesn't make a lick of sense. And if she is responsible, then we'll have to stop her. The Valkyries must be freed, and we are the only ones capable. We? Well, who do you think's gonna watch your back? Betrayeth to me. Good luck, friends. I think your queen did this to you. But why would Sigrun hinder our duty? That's the mystery we're trying to solve, milady. Can you think of any reason she would have to do this? No. Without the Valkyries, those who died in battle will not see Valhalla. Helheim will overflow with the souls of the departed and drown Midgard in a sea of vengeful corpses. No greater shame exists for a Valkyrie. I must go. Attempt to staunch the bleeding. Farewell. I believe you have your answer, Head. The Queen opposes Odin. She imprisoned the Valkyries to defy him. Sigrun hated Odin, no doubt about that. But her duty, her responsibility! Would she really forsake these things to get back at Odin? I don't believe it. I do. Hate is stronger than duty. We have to find the Queen. We have to stop her. Sorry. 
Aye. Don't be sorry, lad. Sigrun brought this on herself. Only wish... Well, wishing only gets you so far. How will we find her? I'm afraid I don't know. She could be anywhere, any realm. We'll find her. We have to. All of Midgard is counting on us. This is none other than Gerdrifo, the master of arms in Valhalla, responsible for arming and training Odin's Inheria. His what? His army, come Ragnarok. The entire reason Valhalla exists, you see. The Inheria wait in the Great Hall endlessly, feasting, drinking, and fat. Ah, uh, fornicating themselves silly. Once Ragnarok begins, Odin calls them into service to fight on his behalf. Gerdrifo had her hands full training that lot. Valkyrie healer? Strange. Air was strange, as a matter of fact. Very quiet. Very calm. Where her sisters were violent rapids, air was a gentle stream. She healed the wounds of both mortals and gods. And even a certain all-knowing sage who once drank too much and fell off a mountain. Ugh, not my proudest moment. Once the daughter of a powerful chieftain. She fell defending him during a reaver attack. Orun was escorted to Valhalla, where she chose to devote her afterlife to the pursuit of knowledge above all else. Quite unusual behavior amongst the constant drinking and feasting of her fellow Valhallian denizens. How'd she end up a Valkyrie? Odin. He saw a kindred spirit in Orun's single-minded pursuit of knowledge. He appointed her as a Valkyrie's resident historian.
freedom. Where is your queen? My queen? She did this to you. She's letting the dead take over Midgar. This cannot be. I didn't want to believe it either, milady. But we have to find her. Where is she? I can't say for sure. But the rock soul of Alkirs. If the Council of Eight are reunited, perhaps she will answer our call. Council of Eight. Looks like this was our last one. Aye, lad. On to the rope stole our Valkyrs then. If you remember, it's next to the two oarsmen statues on the path we took to Thamur's chisel. This queen of yours, she is strong, yes? Stronger than these other Valkyries we have faced. That's putting it mildly, brother. Then we must prepare ourselves. Ragnarok is supposed to be Odin's doom, isn't it? You know what? I'll tell this one later.
Is Rota, accuser of the slain. I thought all the Valkyrie did that. Not exactly, lad. Although that is what they're most famous for, and by far their greatest responsibility. You've seen what happens to the dead without the judgment of the Valkyries. Hellwalkers. That's right. Rota, Gunnar, Skuld. Without them to clean up the aftermath of battle, hell overflows with souls meant for Valhalla. A sorry state of affairs. Rota must be beside herself.
Oh, oh. 